Let's actually start the game finally, shall we? Oh, hello, YouTube. Uh, welcome, 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 welcome. I've had this code card sitting on my desk forever, so if anybody wants a code card, I'm not going to type it out because I'm lazy, but Q Y V H C Y L Z J W H D Z. And now it's in the trash, so <laughs> it'll be in the VOD if anybody missed it. It's fine. It'll be out there in the ether somewhere. Load game, and I actually remembered circle button this time. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, I guess technically topical. To topical? Um, is that actually right? Did you actually type that out in time? Good job, man. Um, I, I'm wearing a 007 shirt, which <laughs> wasn't on purpose or anything. It just kind of, the theme song kind of makes me think of 007, and that reminded me about this whole thing in 007, but... You don't know, but it sounds right. It does sound right, man. <laughs> so if not, it'll be in the VOD. It's fine. Somebody will get it someday. Whatever. <laughs> I have I have enough of them. I'm not that not that worried about it. Like there's we got code cards for days. Like I can if anybody wants a code card or two, man, just hit me up. Maybe I'll give you one or two. The offer's only good for, like, two days, because don't message me weeks from now asking me for shit. I'm going to forget all about it. Anyways, we were in the facility. Uh, I don't remember what we were doing, though. That is what the call thingy's for, though. Let's give Major Zero a call. What are we doing again? Snake, enemy soldiers who operate indoors aren't equipped with radios. To communicate with command, they'll have to use the radio-equipped alarm systems located on the walls. If you're spotted by an enemy, you can avoid going into alert phase by taking him out before he can use the alarm system. That's actually good info. Thank you for that. You'll message in 47 hours. Nice. Nice. Um, I mean, that's nice to know, Major Zero, but it also didn't help me at all. With what I'm trying to do. We're we're a scientist, though. I remember that much. So we're walking instead of running. You haven't met the guy who likes to slap his legs yet? What? You can shoot out radio so they can't call for help. That's pretty cool. So, like... On the wall... What? That's really cool info, actually. Oh, that's right. We were being creepy, Snake. Creeping all over the damn place. We're here, we're looking for Sokolov or whatever, right? I think that's what we're actually here for. Oh, they're walkies, just like in general. Okay, okay, okay. Um, Trying to remember, like, this map at all. So we came from upstairs. There was nothing for us to do upstairs. I do remember that much. And... I also remember that we need to be careful of scientists, like this guy, because they'll actually trigger on us, unlike the soldiers. Oh, God. Let's go. <laughs> we Gucci. They're fucking narcs, exactly. Uh, there was nothing in any of these, I don't think. Nothing important, at least. Sometimes you swear the batter tastes better than the finished product. I mean, that's definitely true for cookies. I don't know if I necessarily agree about that for cake, but for cookies, 100%. So not suspicious. I know, dude. Like, honestly, the way we creep around is more suspicious than anything else. But, I mean, you know what? Honestly, though, if you think of some scientists, like, let's say Hojo from Final Fantasy VII... Is Snake creeping around like this really any more suspicious than just Hojo existing? <laughs> like, I don't think it really is, man. Is there not a door on this side? The posture checks out exactly. Brownie batter's finished better than finished brownies. Uh, yeah. I think I would agree with that, probably. Like, I made brownie batter before with the intention of just eating it. <laughs> like, the batter. Uh, but I've never been able to actually finish it before. Wait, is it locked? 
Ow! What do you think you're doing? You knocked me the hell out. That's what the hell I'm doing. Hey, stop! Well, <laughs> this is going well. Is there anything here? Oh, there is something here. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> we found the basement now we just gotta hide for like two minutes it's you know is it suspicious to be a box in this area probably you gotta freeze it for later that actually does sound like a really good idea man sig gas spray gas spray gun disguises a cigarette what <laughs> Oh, shit, they can see in here, huh? <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe I can just hide in here. They won't ever notice. Uh, our alert's at 99. They totally see me. Where can I hide? Uh, well, I guess right there I could. Um, the Trank Vape? Yes. No, go in the door, snake. I need box. Seriously? You're a dick. Uh, okay. Where is... Stun grenade and then... Wait, are we still in evasion mode? I was just hiding because I'm a scientist. Stop. Let's go, dude. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Okay. Let's go. And that was the cutscene trigger, so like, we Gucci. <laughs> it's fucking hunched over with our knife out, like. Oh my god, dude. Let me turn it up a little bit, I think. If you're looking for Sokolov, he's not here anymore. <laughs> Put that thing away, you'll spoil my drink. No, oh, you're the intruder everyone's talking about. No, not me. Typical capitalist dog. No manners. And who are you? You mean you've never heard of me? And you call yourself an agent? Very well, then. I am Alexander Leonovich Grani. I'm still here. I just had to grab some something. If I do say so myself. I am the foremost weapon scientist in the Soviet Union. And the head of the glorious Granin Design Bureau. This is the Order of Lenin. It is an honor of the greatest magnitude, given along with the title of Hero of Socialism to only the finest workers. It was awarded to me in recognition of my brilliant contributions to society. Since the Great Patriotic War, I have created countless weapons in the service of our great communist society. It was thanks to me that we were able to stamp out the Nazi scum. It was I who created the basic design for the mobile ballistic missile system you know and fear as SS-1C. Oh, you're crocked, aren't you? <laughs> the way our lips don't even I'm move, man. i my sorrow. Because of him, I've got nothing to do but sit here. Drink this crap. Him. 
Sokolov. It's him you're looking for, isn't it? Because of him, I have been stripped of my authority. My research has come to nothing. Look. It is a That's what you're sad about, dude? Nuclear missile system. Not the fact I that your weapons think. have been used to, like, kill millions? Like... <laughs> Bipedal tank. Yes, a walking tank, a robot. That actually kind of sounds with terrible. The theory of the missing link between apes and humans. Well, this technology will be the missing link between infantry and artillery, a kind of metal gear, if you will. And this magnificent metal gear will mark a revolutionary step forward in weapons development. Metal. Here. <laughs> but I won't be used so easily. No, no crying myself to sleep. For you see, I'm going to send these documents to my friend in the United States. What? Wait a second. To regret this. So this is the guy that developed the Metal Gear and gave it to America? They will know my true greatness. Yes. Sokolov's okay. Shagohan pales in comparison to my work. What are you going to do with a rocket engine on a tank? About Sokolov. A tank does not need a rocket. It needs something else. If they're light spoilers, then these. yeah, that's fine. I don't mind. Nice shoes. So honestly, I'll probably no. forget by the time I get around to playing Metal Gear Solid 5 anyways. Legs oh, the there's the guy that... <laughs> <laughs> not light. Mm. That is the yeah, go ahead. It's fine. I don't mind. Don't you agree? It'll probably be quite some time before I play it, anyways. But the fool's in charge. Chose Sokolov. And where is Sokolov? My project has been terminated. The loss of his legacy has been handed over to him. Honestly, it's kind of a weird about? choice that they pick Sokolov over him. Maybe that's just because, like, we already know what the Metal Gear leads to, but... Haven't you heard of the philosophers? No, I have not. The Colonel has inherited their immense Gives them to legacy. Octagon's daddy who's a massive piece of Logan's shit. Oh, good. Do we meet him, like, in this game, or do we not meet him until the future, too? In the confusion of the war, he somehow ended up with their treasure. And Volgin not inherited that, okay. that treasure illegally. We, never need to we may end up, new probably new not right away, but we may end up putting Metal Gear Solid 4 and 5 on the list of games to complete, even though it's not, you know, PS2, strictly. The weapons born here will be the genes for creating an we have other not strictly PS2 game. games on there. Might as well put those ones on, because I am enjoying the series. Like, why the hell not? Just have to out of that buy them. <laughs> I don't think I own either one of them yet. Out of it. Now, my money, my men... All have been diverted to the Nine hours of cutscenes. Nice. Tomorrow they will be conducting the final test. While Sokolov is making the final preparations in the I have Revengeance, Ground Zeroes, and the, the Phantom Pain. I don't have four though. Grad. Here I am playing host to an enemy spy and drinking myself into a stupor. That's where they move Sokolov. Yes. Which one is it that has an like an hour long cutscene? Is that four or five? I think it's five, right? You're not thinking of going to Grozny Oh, it is four? No shit. <laughs> Are you mad? It's an impenetrable fortress. I'll find a way in, my guy. You'll be killed. I'll take my chances. Wait. What? Listen to me, you fool. I want to help you. Help me? To thank you for your compliment. What compliment? My shoes. <laughs> Tatiana gave me. I wanted to thank you for complimenting me. All right. Them. I'll tell you how to get into the fortress. In return, I ask only that you get that. I just realized that our name badge has a picture of us, and it doesn't look anything like our face. Runs around the perimeter of the fortress. But those guards just let us go anyways. Should be able to use it to sneak into the base. Head for the mountains. The entrance to the tunnel is located there. 
take this. You passed through a warehouse on your way here, didn't you? Yeah. There should have been a locked door inside of it. Do you remember it? No, God, dude, not the warehouse again. This key will open that door. Beyond that door lies a vast jungle. You can climb up into the mountains from the far end of the jungle. Go back to the warehouse. Use the key to open the locked door and head for the mountains. Got it? E. Why are you helping me? Unlike Sokolov, the thought of defecting has never once crossed my mind. I love my country. I love this land. I cannot even imagine living anywhere else. That doesn't explain why you're trying to help us, my guy. I wish to remain a hero. Oh, just because you want power. Motherland. That makes sense. I cannot bear the thought of being hounded into a corner and left to waste away. It is already dawn. We must hurry. I will remain here and nurse my troubles for a little longer. To capitalism! All right, then. <laughs> this, this dude's fucking drunk, my guy. Um, Any more cutscenes? No. Okay. So, because of ADD, I'll forget if I don't mention it now. So, I've been working on fixing this, this copy of Pokemon Red for a friend of mine, right? And uh, just a word of warning to people. Uh, so, what ended up being wrong with it? Like, when you're playing it, it would glitch out and uh like completely just randomly usually when entering battles and stuff like that but somewhat randomly would just completely glitch out play random sounds i heard an unreleased song which is pretty cool um because of the glitch but anyways point is the what ended up being wrong with it was they had done the missing number glitch back in the day and they must have messed it up in some way and it caused some semi-permanent harm to the save ram inside of it um basically the save got corrupted in such a way that creating a new game would not fix it um, so just a word of warning, if you ever decide to go back to playing, you know, an original Game Boy game, be careful of doing the missing number glitch, in case you didn't know. Uh, it can cause semi-permanent harm. The The fix is relatively easily easy. There are tools that you can use to fix it. What I did was just remove the battery, because the battery was old and needed replaced anyways. Uh, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, okay. Uh, we have some gunshot wounds and things. I imagine we're going to get into, because I know the end is a sniper, right? And I read a article recently about how Kojima originally wanted the sniper fight in Metal Gear Solid 3 to take place over a very large forest with like multiple stages that you would have to run between and stuff like that. And since the guy just mentioned us running through a forest once we get back to the place, I imagine the sniper fight's probably going to be soon. For that reason, I think it's probably a good idea to go ahead and fix some of our wounds. Uh, so we will do so. Helping broken bones to heal, treating cuts, and disinfect. Another cut, so disinfects, depict, bandage, suture. And then gunshot wounds are this, right? This. And suture? Same, actually, it's the same exact treatment, isn't it? Oh, wait, we need something else? Splint? Ointment? Cigar? Knife? Is it a medicine? Stomach aches? No. What are we missing? Oh, probably the knife to remove a bullet. Yeah, there we go. Oh, did we get to watch Snake stab himself? Uh, 
fun, dude. <laughs> yeah, just dig around in there. There you go, dude. Ouch. Oh, nice. You got to get them fingers in there, too. Could have at least put some, like, disinfectant on your hands first or something, my guy. Ouch. It's a pretty big bullet, too. It's not even, like, a small one. I was expecting, like, a little 9mm round or something. Hmm. Ah, oh, there you go. He got it fixed up on nice, though. Now, don't forget to bandage it. Oh, my God, this guy. I love how you can do this stuff, like, completely out of order, though. Like, yeah, we'll just, uh, completely stitch it up first, and then we'll go ahead and put a bandage on it, and after the bandage, we'll throw on some disinfectant. Like, <laughs> makes perfect sense, right? Um, now, while we were just running through here, I did see that there are some scientists. We ran into some scientists, so we'll need to be careful about that them seeing our face who's james garfield the name does sound vaguely familiar but hmm do we have to like legit sneak through here or do we just can we run in front of the scientists son of a bitch Ah, oh, shit, they already see me? How did they know it was me? Uh, door? Nope. <laughs> Not getting in that one. Wait, wait. Vape nation. Oh, God, that's a grenade. We'll try the vape. We'll try it. Uh, if we get, like, checked out closely, will having no paint on still work? I'm hoping it will. Okay, we probably don't need, I mean, the torch for one, but I was thinking, yeah, I guess the torch. Take off the torch. I know we can't equip. I want to unequip. Oh, the torch isn't equipped right now. I'm, I'm a dumbass. Uh, unequip the book because we're out anyways. Okay, where's the vape? Oh, we can't use... Oh, shit. Oh, wait. No, we can use that. Okay, cool. Gas spray gun disguises a cigarette. Puts enemies to sleep. Press square button to hold. Release to let gas. <laughs> oh, shit. It didn't work. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I'm guessing while on alert, we can't just, like, disguise ourselves. Only while, uh, on, like, evasion mode or whatever. Oh, shit, they're, like, right there, too. Huh, I'm putting the mask back on. Just cause I, I don't know, I feel safer. I don't know if it actually helps, but I definitely feel safer. Kitty doesn't stop licking the can bag. She's joining you to stream with you. The can bag? What's the can bag? You know where some AAA batteries are. Um, maybe uh, I remember seeing some, but I can't remember where. Maybe in that bag on the chair, like behind the green screen back there, or blue screen. Maybe back there. Damn you! He was like waiting for me, dude. Oh, the recycling bag. Okay, that makes sense. I'm just a humble scientist. <laughs> uh. Does the, the vape niche still work while we have the mask on? It does. Oh, that's a that's a that's a gun gun. Ow. There's got to be, like, s 
Oh, we're an invasion. We're an invasion. I'm just a scientist. Don't mind me. <laughs> Thing is, I actually feel like it's probably safest to chill in here as a scientist than it is to go outside. Uh, spoiled. Dispose. 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 All our food is no good. Let's eat a Russian ration. We absolutely love them, after all. I've had enough. Now, I wonder, does the scientist outfit work outside? Maybe we should wade in here for a moment. Oh, this is a door. Can we go out this door? I guess not. Hmm. I don't know. I said we just go outside. Screw it. Worst that happens is we get shot again, right? Like, <laughs> like we haven't been shot a million times before. It's fun. Surely the scientists are allowed to walk around outside too, right? You don't want to go to class today, but you got to? I feel it, my guy. I mean, they're like basically looking at me and... I'm not running away, I'm just... Oh shit, my internet went out, didn't it? Ah, fuck, dude. It's always something, man. Oh shit, we got locked up. Oh! Scientists aren't allowed outside, so they get locked up. That makes sense. Is the stream live? No, it's not. <laughs> Is it? I can't... No. Bitrate, zero. Dropped frames, zero. Reconnecting. Okay. So, yeah. The, <laughs> my internet must have went down. Which, you know, is awesome. Uh, Or did just... Whatchamacallit go down? Twitch. It might just be Twitch. Let me check my internet. Here. Uh, No, my internet on my phone. I'm getting 400 megabits a second. So, let me turn off... 5G just to make sure. I'm pretty sure it wasn't that, but yep, it's still working just fine. So it begins, right? I think we're back up now, though. Hopefully it stays up for a little bit, but we're back up now, I think. Say hello if if, if we're up. <laughs> oh. Okay, turn that back. I think I think everything's good. Let me uh click here to reload. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything seems to be back up. Hopefully, hopefully it stays up. All right. So we got arrested, which sucks, but at the same time, like Oh, oh, there's vents in here. The vents probably, oh, go between the two different, like, the one side and the other side. Which, actually, it's easier to escape from the side that I think we're on. If if we are where I think we are, which I guess is what the map is for. Can't really tell. I am curious, though. What is down at the end of it here map again yeah map is not great yeah it's really not um yeah it doesn't seem it seems like this is just a dead end is it oh it's because it's got a grate on it okay but i mean surely 
there's something like hidden all the way down at the end of it here, they wouldn't just have you go all the way down here to waste your time, would they? Oh, here's the one that's locked. Is there anything in here? There's a stinky toilet. Other than that, it looks empty, so no. Guessing not. What kind of prison just has an open set of vents leading to the cells, though, man? And no, there literally is nothing here. Wow. Oh, hi, my guy. Is it possible to, like, action this to do anything? No. Alrighty, then. Back to the open cell that they shoved this in. I hear noodles searching behind me. I think they're having problems. <laughs> you not finding the triple A's? Um, take one out of one of the Roku remotes. Or take some out of one of the Roku remotes. Because we have extra Roku remotes. Huh? Like, we don't need all of them. We only need one Roku remote. Yeah, but we don't need them. Like, it's fine. I have one on the desk over here if you can't find the the one that we don't like as much. Yeah, thankfully this is the side that I'm pretty sure is easy to escape from, which is nice. So this is the side we were originally on when we got, like, lost forever. I don't think there's any scientists or anything over here that we really need to worry about. Goodbye. I hope they work for you. First person mode would make this game so much easier, man. Because, like, right now, I have a vague idea of what we're walking into just because we've been through this area a couple of times. But without that, I would be 100% lost right now. So I'm pretty sure there's no scientists to worry about. Just, just dudes with guns. But thankfully, the dudes with guns aren't the smartest people. They literally looked at our face, looked at our badge, and was like, yo, you're the same person. Okay. So when we get outside, we need to change out of the scientist uniform or... I guess that's pretty much it. Or just not get caught. Because if they see us in the scientist's uniform, it's just automatic arrest. Like, they didn't even give us a chance to try and run away or anything. Not that I noticed, at least. Now, is that guy going to yell at us for trying to escape? Or are, we, or are we okay? I think we're okay to go to here. Hopefully, there's not, like, a guard as soon as we walk out to arrest us. There are guards around, though. So, shit. Wrong button. Camouflage. Face. Uh, zombie, because whatever. Uniform. Uh, splitter? Splitter seems pretty good, although that's probably going to change as soon as we get off this concrete slab. Yeah, <laughs> definitely changed. Back to the camouflage. Chocolate chip? Chocolate chip's pretty good. Love how, love how this supposedly makes us invisible, dude. Like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure even with camouflage on, a dude just crawling around on some bricks is going to be pretty visible, I feel like. Now, how did we get in here? There's a door somewhere. I think it's over there somewhere. Something there. 
Uh, nothing here. That's right, you're seeing things. <laughs> I love how we can't crawl off this tiny little ledge. Like, oh, God damn it, and somebody else is coming. Um, how close are you going to get? Seems like you're going to get pretty close. Who's that? Damn you! Ow! <laughs> Come in, HQ. There's nobody here! Da, 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 da. You ended up finding a couple of batteries that you don't think have been used as much? Well, okay. Well, I'm glad you found some, though. That's, that's the important part. Oh damn it, they saw me right as I was laying down. Where do they see me from? Oh, doggy! Not nice, doggy. Ow. We seem to have a lot more health in this game than we did in the other Metal Gear Solid games. Oh my god, we're taking a lot of hits though. <laughs> Uh, right around here? Yes. Bad doggy. Hey, look, dinner. How do we... Oh, knife. There we go. Okay, they, they see us. <laughs> just, <laughs> just run <laughs> for a minute. It's fine. Everything is fine. Thankfully, they're behind a fence and they don't know how to get out, so... Oh, wait, really? They can't see us right here? <laughs> is anybody going to come from the other direction? Could probably put on better camo now. Make us a little harder to see. Olive drab leaf. Get that leaf though. Face uh woodland. Look at us go, dude. Seventy five percent camouflaged. Basically invisible. Nobody will ever see us. Of course we don't stay on the ground. Ah, oh, cool. Cutscene. We should be fine. Wait, is this the... <laughs> Shit, this is probably the boss fight, ain't it? This is not what I expected. Never mind. I'm pretty sure that's not the end. <laughs> oh, it's fear. Ah. You be fast, dude. Hi, vamp. Fighter soldier. Ah. Venom of the Brazilian wandering spider. Soon the most exquisite pain will engulf your entire body. Your limbs Excellent. will be paralyzed. Your lungs cease to draw breath. Eventually your heart will stop beating. Ah, but what fun would that be? No. Not a fitting death at all. The boss is a friend. I will give you fear such as you've never experienced before. Come into my web. It is time. Bro, you kind of fucked up. <laughs> okay, so. Shit, how do we deal with him? <laughs> He's invisible. Uh, 
call. Okay. I will gladly answer the call. Give me any info you can. Shot with a poison bolt. The poison is spreading throughout your body. Your life is going to keep decreasing unless you do something about it. Hurry and neutralize the poison. Go into the survival viewer and use cure to give yourself a serum injection. Will do. The serum will neutralize the poison, but don't forget to treat the bolt wound itself as well. To treat a bolt wound, you'll need your knife, a styptic, and a disinfectant. Okay. Use your knife to dig out the bolt, and then apply styptic and disinfectant to the wound. Follow those steps, and the wound should heal right up. Now start the treatment. Hurry! Theorem, knife, stipic, something. Uh, serum? Knife? Stipic disinfectant? Uh, suture? Bandage. There we go. <laughs> it's bandage. That was the magic one. You have chicken nuggies and you're happy? Dude, chicken nuggies do sound good. Noodle brought me home some McDonald's today. It was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Okay. <laughs> we need... How do we deal with this guy? First off, I don't think I need the suppressor. So we can save some suppressor usage with that. Um... Eat a tiny bit of food. Probably another calorie mate. Uh, I guess we don't know anything about the snake. Okay. Snake was probably a good choice. Some hot dogs. Nice. I do like hot dogs. I haven't had... Uh, well, no, that's a lie. I got some a couple weeks ago. But other than that, I haven't had hot dogs from like a hot dog place in a while. And specifically, our local hot dog shop. But... Your dental work done and you got him food, right? Isn't she so sweet? She just had some fillings. <laughs> it's not like she had some major surgery done or anything. Oh shit, there's still traps around here? Uh. I didn't realize we were still dealing with traps. How do we deal with this guy? I think he's there he is damn you I just saw you dude Where'd he go? Damn you. <laughs> We're gonna die. There's no, like, healing items in this game, right? Unlike uh, the other ones. Yeah, because food just, like, heals over time. Life medicine just brings us back to life from what I remember. Food doesn't actually heal us. It just gives us stamina to heal over time. This is going to be a hard one, dude. Uh, bandage, suture, disinfect, stipic, stipic, disinfect, bandage, suture. Nope. Oh, knife, because the crossbow bolt. There we go. This is one of the harder bosses. I can imagine, especially with as low as our health is right now. Uh, and yes, and traps. I didn't know there were also explosive traps around. Holy shit. Rosive. <laughs> How do we... I think we need the knife. How do we deal with this? We dealt with this before, but I don't... Can I just shoot while I'm here? Oh, well, okay. It's fine. We're dead. <laughs> oh, 
I'll just try again. It's okay. Do we get a uh a health refill maybe? No, not really. Triangle. Ah, uh, that's the one. Okay. Is it the same call? Poison. It is. All right, serum it up. Venomous poisoning medicine serum. Arrow wound, which I mean, honestly, isn't the end of the world, but. And then it was what? Bandage and disinfectant? No, stipic. Is it better to just kind of like stand in one place? Come on. Damn you. Take off the suppressor, I don't need it. Yeah. Trying to like listen. He's behind me. Good thing he's a shit shot. Motion detector, that's not a bad idea. Thermals, of course. I'm not a quick enough shot for this. He's actually not that bad, though, in terms of, like, health compared to the other ones. Like, that bee dude sucked major ass, man. Damn it. Where'd he go? Shit. I hear him. I don't see him. Don't let him get a minute away. Oh, is he healing? Where is he? Shit! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> we were so close! <laughs> there he is. Ow. We're gonna run out of ammo though, dude. Oh, and we're poisoned too, aren't we? Uh you know, we're just gonna we're just gonna restry. We're gonna let the poison take us because we're so close to death. But we get we got it. We got it. The thermal goggles, that's that's a huge help, man. <laughs> that, that makes it a hell of a lot easier. Alright, heal. Uh cure. Medicine. Serum. Knife. Disinfect. Bandage? Not night vision, thermals. One thermals and you, but without the suppressor. Damn it, dude. I'm not a good enough shot for this. I feel like he probably has a semi-predictable pattern we could follow.
Sorry, focusing. Shit. Where, where are you going? Damn it, dude. It doesn't even take him a minute. Where'd he go? Is that him? No. He's back in the air. Son of a bitch. We're legit not going to have enough ammo to do this unless we get him in like one go. How am I supposed to? You can't even hit me. Is that him? That was him. <laughs> Ow, you bastard. <laughs> stop shooting for a second so I can stop. Done as well. Ah, not, not a bad idea. Yeah, let's try let's try the stun. I was really hoping that ammo we picked up would be for the the trank, the MK22. about this ammo that's grenades I'm just gonna spend a moment searching for oh this is mud oh he uses the small animals to heal I guess that's good to know but couldn't he still just use the uh like the fruit and stuff. Ow. We poisoned. I think we're poisoned. It seems like our tranks have an effect on him over time as well, which is nice. So it's more a matter of just shooting him every now and then, not necessarily shooting him a bunch in a row. Right, yeah, because it's still going down for him. So anytime he starts to hunt for food is when we really need to worry about him. Oh, he uses stamina jumping. Oh, no, he's losing stamina right now, just sitting there, though. Right? Ow. I pick up the food. He can't pick up the food. Hmm. <laughs> Speaking of food, though. I feel like a poison dart frog's not a good thing to eat. <laughs> Came down with food poisoning. I mean, <laughs> that makes sense. He just uses stamina living. I mean, fair, I guess. <laughs> uh, arrow wound, arrow wound, burn. Okay. You freaking weirdo. Where's he at? Hey, bullets! Damn you! I was looking for you, sir. I really don't like you. Especially because we were so close at one point. 
but he eats that food quick. Ow. Well, I think we lost this one. <laughs> we're going to try, but I think we're going to have to try one more time. Arrow wound, burn. Arrow wound, arrow wound. Okay, so no, no poison. I'm not worried about healing this stuff because I'm pretty sure we lost this one anyways. You're at 20k points. What are you saving up for? He wasn't so bad when he was just jumping around, man. <laughs> when he starts running around on the ground, that's where it like starts to get me, man. Give him love with Trank. When he comes out of the trees, just fill the jungle with stun. That's a really good idea. Okay, cure. Venom poisoning. Serum. Uh, we're already in the menu. Might as well. Knife. Bandage. Stipic. Uh, We also need thermal goggles. And... This would be really helpful. Now I'm here. I hear him. I don't see him. There he is. I missed. There we go. Damn, dude. I'm so bad with a joystick and shooters. How did that one miss? He jumped to. There he is. Damn, I think I hit the tree. Shit, I just saw him. There we go, dude. <laughs> Didn't even need the grenades. Just had to not miss a thousand times in a row. <laughs> <laughs> huh. The fear. The fear. I see it. The fear. Dude, I think you're legit crazy, my guy. What the? F <laughs> He's just filled with knives. I'm assuming those are all poisonous bolts. Okay then. <laughs> that dude's just 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 a little wild, man. All right, that actually didn't go too badly. Filled with bolts and small critters. All of them, man. Psychos. Thermal camo. Wait, what? I get the thermo. Oh shit. <laughs> what do we need to change our camo for? We already have on pretty decent camo, don't we? Oh, thermal to find the camo. That makes sense. Okay. It also, the other nice thing about thermal is that it points out, like, the traps. There it is. Uniform spider. I want to get, I don't know what that is, but, oh, another book. Yeah, the thermal's actually a little bit OP, man. It points out the food, the ammo, the books, like, the traps. I know there was more ammo. I don't know if it persists after the boss fight. But I would really like more ammo for the MK-22.
Looks like it doesn't really persist after the uh, boss fight, which is fair. The snare, I think we're just... Wait, isn't this the way out? Yeah, okay, just had to hop up. All right, <laughs> let's freaking go, dude. Gotta adjust myself real quick. Get comfy. Wait. <laughs> Hold on. This isn't the right spot. I thought... We're heading south, I guess, not north. <laughs> Try that again, dude. <laughs> Since we ended on the other side, I thought... Yeah, what? Okay, so we're going down. This way. Not that way. That way's trapped. weird hanging fruit in the sky. Mud. This way. There we go. I didn't realize like it had a standing at where we were trying to get to. Okay, take these off. Hopefully there's nobody like I re okay, I think I remember where we are like spatially. Zombies fine, I guess. Uniform. Splitter? Spider. What does spider do? Why is it so good? Fierce camo uniform gives wear stealth capability at the cost of stamina. Oh. Hence the living cost him stamina thing but well, we have food like we have a lot of food it cost a lot of stamina though doesn't it are there people here wait is this place why is it so empty I don't remember it being this empty. This uh, we hate Russian rat. Well, you know what? Let's eat some of our live food. They knew this works. And if it's going to be completely empty here, I guess we don't need the fears camo. Which does seem really good, but... Splitter? Splitter looks like the best. Yeah. What a thrill. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Wait, Snake Eater? Is that the song? Are you, <laughs> are you singing the song? What was... Ah, oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, box. Ah, oh, shit, they saw me go in the box. Never mind, I take back the box. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> uh, I thought, dude, <laughs> I didn't see anybody. I finally was like, you know what? This place seems f safe enough. It was not. Oh, that was a complete reset. Dope. Better get going. You got to get to class earlier so you can discuss what to say during your presentation. Fair. Have a good presentation, my guy. Okay, so there would appear to be some people down here. I just can't see them. Are they invisible? Now, maybe the stun grenades. Can I see them on thermal? I can. Now, I'm pretty sure there's more than one, though.
if I take one down, that's not instantly going to alert another? Okay, there's another one like down there, down there. I thought there was another one, like, right here. There's one down there. Nothing there. Damn straight you are. Yeah, uh, get down. Honestly, hold on. You know what? <laughs> Let's try that spider camo, dude. I'm just gonna try to run through this damn place. Spider. There's the door we're trying to get to. It's the one where I was hiding at before, right? Well, okay. Well, it didn't work, but you know what? Who cares? Okay, must not be that door. <laughs> Where are we trying to go? Is it this door? This is the right side, right? Got it. Okay. Whew. So the spider camo is not in Favio, which I mean, fair. Oh, damn. We are almost completely out of stamina. Let's take that off. Uniform. Not naked. Black. Black seems best outside of spider. Food. Reticulated python, which I think was pretty good. And some rat. And a shitty Russian ration. Gross. I don't see why we hate the Russian ration so much. Like, surely they're more or less edible, right? Do we heal? Nah, I think we're fine. Like, you would think they would heal more than just... Raw animals. What is this? Why is this lighting up? Is that some sort of like stuff we can collect? It's a lot of brain pate. You're not joking. What? <laughs> why? Why is it brain pate? Gross. <laughs> Snake, are you there? Eba, where are you? In the fortress in Groznygrad. Dr. Sokolov is here, too. Is he all right? He's fine. Right now, he's busy putting the finishing touches on the Shagglehod. Good. That means they haven't killed him. Not yet, anyway. But you better hurry. They've already finished the Phase Two tests. Once the final preparations are complete, they'll have no more use for him. The Colonel won't have any qualms about killing him if he thinks the CIA is closing in. Eva, you can't let Sokolov out of your sight. I'd rather have, like, stale bread, though, than just a bunch of brain pate. Granin told me that I should be able to get there from the mountains to the north through an underground tunnel. Granin told you? Yeah. He even gave me the key to the warehouse. Why? Because he was drunk, I guess. You've got to be kidding me. Hell if I know. Snake, there's one problem with that route. What problem? The mountain entrance to the underground tunnel that leads to the fortress is sealed. You need a key to get in. A key? What about the key Granin gave me? That key won't work. But don't worry, I'll figure something out. I have an idea. There are some ruins at the top of the mountains. Meet me there. The top of the mountains. Got it. Okay. Top of the mountains, ruins. You'll find a key for us, apparently. Wait. There's something else I've got to tell you. Now what? I heard that one of the cobras is waiting for you in the jungle at the foot of the mountains. He's a legendary sniper called 
the end. Yeah, I've seen him before. That ridiculous the old guy, right? Don't underestimate him. He's known as the father of modern sniping. Is he alone? No spotter? None. He's all by himself. Apparently, he doesn't need a spotter. You can't be serious. The entire forest is on his side. The forest? Stay alert. Yeah. I'd hate to have it be the end for me. The puns. I mean, we already took him out once. How hard can it be? Hand cur bullet. How's the hand cur? We must have missed it somewhere. Seems more or less empty. I'm just a little suspicious of emptiness now. Oh, it's just a snake, okay. More goodies? Disinfectant? Uh, I mean, I don't think we really need any more disinfectant right now. What is that? Is that food, or...? There's a theory that Snake smoked something so strange from his cigar that he actually hallucinated the Cobra unit actually having power. <laughs> well, first off, welcome to the chat, Phantom Foxhound. And uh, that is an interesting theory for sure. <laughs> it sure would explain a lot. But what are the chances of every snake finding some weird drugs, man, <laughs> that make them hallucinate superhuman people? I mean, I guess father like son and all that, right? Okay. Again, seems more or less clear. Still very suspicious, though. Besides, Solid Snake himself said this is real life, not some fantasy game. Also, Snake has the solar gun. I don't know what the solar gun is. It's either from a game I haven't played yet or I've missed it, one or the other. Any traps I need to worry about? No. Not yet, at least. Again, suspiciously empty. These mushrooms. Oh, and antidote. Cool. There's a trap or something up there. One of the, like, pit-style traps, yeah? Yeah. Doesn't look like any people, though. What's up with this tree, though? Is this tree climbable? No? Hmm. Builder kind of is from a Konami game called Boktai. Snake used in Metal Gear Solid 4 and Peace Walker when unlocked by some reward. Very cool. Yeah, I've never played 4. I've only played... There's a person. I've only played uh, 1, 2, 3 in the original NES game. And while I haven't finished 3 yet, obviously, I'm still playing through it. We do have our suppressor equipped. Yes, good. Down, Snake. Just one person patrolling? Here to be. Thankfully, this black camo is working exceedingly well. I think we're good to hide you. I don't see anyone else around here. Okay, 22 bullets. Perfect.
And as soon as I say something about the black camo, it stops being super effective. Who's that? Bitch, dude. <laughs> I, I didn't realize he was that close. I had 80% camo. I thought we were good. Good job missing with every punch and kick there, my guy. I need to find a safe spot. That's a trap. Oh, God. I didn't see that trap. Uh, <laughs> We're so screwed. Stun grenades. I always forget stun grenades exist. That's a trap, too. <laughs> There's just traps everywhere, isn't there? <laughs> I don't think we're going to get a free reset this time like we did the past couple of times, but it would be nice, though, if the game wants to be kind. Wait, did it? No, it didn't. Okay. Okay, get down. What's the best camo for what we have right now? Probably forest, I'm assuming. Uh, Tiger Stripes 45. I mean, the Snake, obviously. Hornet Stripes are actually pretty decent. And Animals. Let's try one of those. You always made fun of the fact that MGS2 NPCs from the CO team always sounded more Russian than the NPCs here. In <laughs> That's a fair point, honestly. What I liked is how well they blended into the environment. They really do, dude. Do you an opt eject to play Heavenly Bodies, please, or Dorse or whoever? What is Heavenly Bodies? Oh shit, they saw me? I tried to grab him. It didn't work. <laughs> the whole system for CQC with like lightly pressing circle is weird. But what is Heavenly Bodies? Well, that gave us a free reset. Uh, since we're definitely coming across a lot of people now, I guess it's a good time to heal ourselves. Well, to, to fix our wounds. A little space game you just saw on TikTok and you were crying? Doesn't sound like my kind of game. <laughs> just throwing that out there. <laughs> Gunshot wound. Okay, let's just fix all of them. Knife. Bandage. Uh, stipic. This is a burn. It's weird that the ointment is under the surgery tab and not the, the medicine tab. Uh, is it just bandage? Yeah. Arrow wound. That one's about to heal on its own. I'll leave it. Knife, bandage, stipic, nice, and suture, stipic, disinfect, bandage, there we go. It's game beast physics in space, but not PvP. They had to assemble that. Wait, the the heavenly bodies? Mm. You've heard of it? I've never even heard of it before. Don't stand up. No, don't stand up. I'm just assuming during our running we went more or less the right way. <laughs> don't actually know. Okay, there's two people over there, so can we just go around them, maybe? Seems safe so far. Until, like, somebody just comes up on me from behind and screws my whole day up.
I don't see anything dangerous. I'm too scared to stand up and walk, but <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Think there's anything over there to worry about? Well, seems fine. Is that a building? That is a building. Buildings mean guards, though. In fact, I can see one. Only one? Not bad. You also have a motion detector? detector? Yeah, I honestly, like kind of prefer the thermal <laughs> the motion detector except for like seeing around corners and stuff obviously the uh the motion detector is very handy with or for but that was a bad shot now you're down but in open spaces like this dude honestly the thermals are just really good plus the fact that they show traps and stuff like that I think it was just those two. Animals are undeniably S tier. It is really good, isn't it? Plus, was it animals that has the effect where your gun doesn't sway, or was that the uh, the other one? The pain one. I don't remember which camo is which now, but anyways. <laughs> or, nah, I think it is this one, right? Because we got this one from uh, the cat dude. Uh, uh, da -da -da -da, not Otacon, but... Ocelot. Fly camo's S+. Plus. Mm. <laughs> Is it? I haven't actually tried it. I remember its effect was, uh, like, that you're so stinky that people don't want to mess with you or whatever. Like, <laughs> doesn't exactly sound S+, plus to me, though. No, don't. Snake, you're a dumbass, and you probably have a broken leg now. Good job. Oh, I just heard someone come out. Uh, <laughs> There's nobody here. How do we drop down? Is it triangle? Yeah, okay. There we go. That seems better. If I drop down, am I just going to fall through this roof? It's It's not looking too good. No, we good. Any crappy food? Guess we don't know what spots it does. Became sleepy? Really? <laughs> Wait, what? How do I deal with that? <laughs> By call scaly tooth? Barely noticed. Well, I mean, it did its job. What is the sleepy thing going to do to me? Oh, it literally just knocks me out temporarily. Uh, how <laughs> how long are we like this? Do I need to do something to fit? Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's like take the analog stick, so it'll speed it up. I would not be surprised. Kojima and all that. There's a hole. Can't really see anything down in there, though. Why is my watch blowing up? Is that a person? No. That's just like a bunch of junk, right? Is there any reason for me to even be in this building? We good. Everything's fine. Maybe if I look at it from down here? No.
Ah, I'm gonna go in it, I think. Seems empty enough. What the what? Oh, I'm assuming they just found. Oh no. Okay, we're good. M63 American light machine gun. Press square button lightly to hold, firmly to fire. Okay. We just happened to drop down at, like, the perfect time. <laughs> Can we go through this trap door here? Close the door. Occupado. Thank you. Yeah, like... Trank. Ah, trank. There's like a water shader on the screen right now. That's weird. I don't know how well it's coming through on Twitch, but there's like everything's like shivering in a really weird way. I guess it's meant to be like smoke or dust. So I'm, I'm guessing we're going to that next building over there now. There was nothing, I mean, new guns are cool, but nothing exceedingly helpful in this one. 80 camo is really good. I think we'll be fine just crawling over here. Is this an outhouse? Oh, maybe not. I was expecting there to just be like a hole in the ground for people to poop through. There is a hole in the wall, though. Looks clear. I guess th these are the situations where we should be using the motion detector, probably, but... Some free food. Always nice. But at the end of the day, wholly unhelpful. Um, shits and giggles. Hell yeah. All right. So I guess this was the wrong way to go. <laughs> we need to go back around. Where all of the soldiers were, which, I mean, I shouldn't be surprised by, right? Of course, there's going to be more guards in the, uh, the the important areas than the less important areas. That just makes sense, honestly. And try the motion detector. I don't remember there being any serious traps or anything around here that we had to worry about. It was that one pit trap, but I think we're a fair bit past that. There might be a dude or something over there. It's hard to tell with the motion detector. It's getting farther away, so if it is a dude, we're probably fine. Maybe we just, like, went around the soldiers entirely? That'd be helpful. This feels, like, too close to where we just were to be the right direction. <laughs> I 
Check the map again. It is. <laughs> Wait, what? So where are we trying to go? Was this whole section of the map just useless? <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, this just gets us up here. Well, that's annoying. <laughs> okay. Coming up on where we started detecting that motion. I'm gonna slow it down. Keeping an eye on the motion detector. I don't see anything. Again, this place feels suspiciously empty. Which is normally when we get caught and shot a million times. See a couple blips. The other side of that hill. Which way are we going to get out of here, though? we got to be getting close by now. Yeah, okay, so if they're walking around that way, I can probably just crawl right on out of here. Pretend they don't even exist. we got good camo. They ain't going to see us. Let's go. All right, so then in this area, uh, we got to try not to get caught. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's basically the whole game. But <laughs> all right, snake it down. There's a lot of blips, dude. I don't know what's people and what's animals, though. Again, we got pretty decent camo. As long as we don't, like, fuck up and stand up or anything, we might be okay. Huh? Who is that? Hold on. Camo suddenly not nearly as good. Uniform. Leaf. Let me just get naked right in front of this dude, change my clothes. All right, 75. That's pretty solid. Who's that? What's wrong? Radio, call HQ. Damn it, they see me. Bruh! Hold on. <laughs> let me let me check the map. Where are we trying to go? Cuz I'm about to just run past these people and say screw it. I'm assuming to the north. Yeah, maybe through here. Socro... Socroveno? <laughs> South? I can't. I don't speak Russian. I don't know what it says. Oh, dope. Cutscene. That'll reset our thing, too. Let's go. What the hell? <laughs> oh, he's sleeping. <laughs> hello? 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 
Is the parrot his spotter? Is that how that works? Yo, he's got one creepy eyeball. I beg of you. Grant me the strength to take this final prey. Let me linger in this world just a little longer. Is he literally receiving divine intervention right now? For one lifetime. Enough for an eternity. You have my thanks. I have to thank you for waking me. If you hadn't shown up, my sleep would have been eternal. It's fucking I, man. I am the end. I am here to send you to your ultimate fate. You'll make a fine quarry for my ancient final sniper. Hunt. The end. I see thermal goggles possibly being quite helpful again. Eva, I found that sniper you were talking about. That's the end. He's a legend known as the father of sniping. I've got experience sniping in urban and marine environments. What about the forest? Never. I see. Well, that forest is divided into three areas, a river, a plateau, and a clearing. He should be lying in wait for you in one of those places. Sounds like this may take a while. It'll be a test of endurance. Be careful, though. From what I've heard, the End has an almost supernatural knack for camouflaging himself. So, whoever moves first loses. This guy's over a hundred years old, though, so I should have the advantage in terms of stamina. I wouldn't be so sure if I were you. Why's that? I've heard that his body is photosynthetic. Like a what? <laughs> How's this guy just photosynthesizing energy right now? What? So in other words, he knows it inside out. Uh-huh. But he doesn't know you. I'm sure you can beat him. Don't worry. I intend to. So how long do we have to lay here before he just dies? <laughs> Okay, well, first off, we're going to want the sniper. Do, we should have the Trank sniper, if I remember correctly. Um, You're not sure on the exact time? Do you have to, like, turn off the game for it to work? Or does it just, like, if you just survive long enough, does he just roll over and break? <laughs> That'd be pretty funny, honestly. Just said it ahead two years, yeah. <laughs> do you get, like, fancy dialogue or anything? Should I do that just for the laws? I will. Just because I'm curious what it does. I'll do it now. Uh, save. Snake, you want to save? Yeah. You might not want to. Why wouldn't I? Well, it just feels like something bad could happen. It's just your imagination. I hope so. Uh... I'm assuming that something bad happening is just the dude dying, not like something bad actually happening to us, right? <laughs> we'll, we'll make a whole new file for this. Should have saved before we came in here, but I guess I didn't know it was going to happen. Just in case. Now I'm worried. Is it going to fuck something up? I don't think it will, right? Because we can just reload from this save. Sure that, surely she's just talking about the possibility of the end dying. 
save successful. Okay. Make sure you come back as soon as you can. Okay, that's all it was. Okay, yeah. That that reassures me a little bit. A hey, snake, have you seen Dracula yet? I'm in the middle of an active sniper situation, lady. <laughs> right, I gotta I gotta get up so I can actually press the button. One of the problems with playing with, you know, real hardware. That's not going to work. I got to pop open the dish tray, too. I didn't. <laughs> I'm not thinking straight. Give me a sec. Now the dish tray's popped open. Uh, system configuration. Lock. Be suddenly in 2025, boys. <laughs> I don't have to save or anything, right? It just does it. Pretty sure. And... Close the dish tray. Shit. Circle. You haven't seen that in a long time. <laughs> yeah. I kind of take it for granted because I see it fairly regularly with all of this stuff, you know? Doing the PS2 gauntlet and whatnot. There's something nostalgic about playing on real hardware, man. It's uh not necessarily as clean or as convenient as playing with just, like, emulators and stuff like that. But you get better compatibility. There is that. And just the nostalgic feels, man, of using, like, an actual PS2 controller. Now, granted, I do have an adapter for uh, PS2 to USB, so I could use a regular PS2 controller on PC. But, like, using the real controller, putting the disc in, all that stuff, it's kind of neat. Although, I think, I don't know if, like, any of the major PS2 emulators support it, but I know there are some emulators out there that will let you actually play, like, off a disc if you put it in your PC's disc drive, assuming you have one. Which is neat. Oh. Load game. All right. How well did you photosynthesize, my guy? It's been two years that <laughs> we've been duking it out in this uh, jungle, apparently. Are there Easter eggs on killing the other people? Because, like, there's at least two for killing this guy. Which is just weird. Like... Is he dead, like, just laying there, or sitting there, holding the gun? Drop your weapon. Bro, he must have been laying there really freaking still. <laughs> to just, <laughs> or sitting there, whatever. I can't word. So, like, if we had killed him earlier, or, like, kept that save where we had killed him earlier, would he have just, like, Major, not been here at all? The end. He's dead. What the hell happened? Maybe it was from old age. You mean he kicked the bucket in the middle of a battle? Here, Maybe, man. Yeah. Well, Snake, the victory is yours. No, I don't think so. What do you mean? It was his dying wish to fight me. But I disappointed him. Snake, I, listen to This is a mission. It's not a game, it's not a sport. I kind of feel bad, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> gold or or I guess you're right. Taking an old man's dying <laughs> wish, like, that does actually feel a little shitty, dude. Grandpa. 
Jesus Christ. <laughs> Why do they all blow up? <laughs> what is up with these people? Oh, he blew up into birds. That's really pretty. I have a soft spot for old dudes. At least when they're not dicks. Yeah. And I'm assuming that we don't get his camo for winning that way, right? Yeah. Which is why we are going to reload. Just wanted to see what happened, you know? Because Kojima, cool Easter eggs, curiosity, all that stuff. How far back was my other save? Um, from when we started today. <laughs> we didn't have any other saves. <laughs> so, hopefully it works. Now, she said, like, come back soon. Right before, like, we actually started. So, like, I think it's fine. Or, like, from, from whenever the, the save happened. Like, yeah. Yeah, I think it'll be fine, too. I think they were just warning us, like, not to be gone for too long sort of thing in case we want to fight him. If if he dies, he dies. It's not the end of the world because I'll just keep the other save and we can always, like, come back to see it or whatever. Or, I mean, if we just run through everything, it wouldn't take that long either. The longest part would be the, the boss fight, but, meh. I don't think it's going to be a problem. I think it's going to be okay. We hope, at least. Yeah. Successful. Is he dead? About to find out. Wonder what happens if we travel backwards in time. I'm assuming nothing, but... Unless it's just doing a simple comparison. Yeah, no. See, we're good. Nothing happened. Okay. Um, first things first. Weapon. I don't think the cigar gas spray is going to do much for us here. We're not going for kills, so we might as well unequip... Wait. Unequip that one, not this one. Uh, We want... Which one's the non-lethal? That's a shotgun. High precision, so that's not the trank one. Wait, do we not have... The tranquilizing sniper? A directional mic. That's a good, good idea. I thought we had the. Oh, you get it from the end. So wait. Does that mean the only way to not kill the end is to use the pistol? Uh, okay. <laughs> that that sounds bad. That sounds bad. Bad. <laughs> All right. Let's uh. Let's just change our loadout entirely. We don't need the cigar gas spray. We don't need regular grenades. They all explode either way. Non-lethal for gun and camo. Yeah, I want to go non-lethal, though. Damn, dude. Uh, stun grenade, maybe. Chaff grenade. Not really electronics, at least right now. If you're fast enough, you can trank his bird? What? That's pretty cool. Smoke could be helpful. Directional mic is a yeah. I'll post fight. Wait, uh, can you like eat it? <laughs> is it? Is it like a food that you can pick up? That's kind of great. 
uh, Russian ration. <laughs> I'm assuming that's a yes. <laughs> that's awesome. Okay. Uh... In a sniper battle, like, I'm sitting here thinking having the suppressor on would be good, but I don't actually know. Is that my breathing or his? I guess I could tell just by turning. This is the end. He's definitely that direction. Just straight ahead. Does he show up on thermal? <laughs> Trying to make it to this next spot here. They said, like, he has supernatural camouflaging ability. That's the only reason why I'm not, like, sure. Use night vision? How does night vision help? That seems... What? <laughs> I'm, like, turning my head like that's going to help me here. Turn my headphones up, though. He's definitely right up there, dude. I can very clearly hear him. mute the stream for a moment. Make this a lot easier. One of them helps you find footprints. I'm guessing it thermals would, but I, I don't know, though. is the night vision. Maybe the night vision just like makes him stand out more or something? I don't know. He's, like, right there. That's him. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I know where you are. I hit you. <laughs> Wait, why is my stamina going down? And it's, uh, he uses one. Oh. Okay. That makes sense why we get it from him. That's the weapon he uses. Now, he's not going to stay in the same spot, though, right? Kind of sounds like he is, though.
He's on the other side of that tree. Problem is, I'm pretty sure he sees me. What are you trying to do? Trying to shoot you. I think he left. That's just a plant, right? Yep, that was just a plant. Let's try the night vision real quick. Well, I guess the night vision... Yeah, we can't see that far with it. Uh... No hint anywhere. We like jump down from here. Is that that bad idea? I mean, he went running this way. Oh, dude, you can totally see footprints. Oh, well, I guess you can kind of see footprints either way. What's it do with the thermal? Oh, uh, the thermal, they actually light up. I don't know if it'll be different for his footprints, but... I'm thinking he's completely out of this area, area? <laughs> area now. Do we actually, like, load into another area? Yeah. Okay. Because of all of the complaints from people with this fight, whenever Kojima had it be this giant thing, I wonder if that's why he put in so many Easter eggs on different ways to beat it. But he's over here. Yeah, he's like right there but on the other side of that wall. The real question is, can we see the other side of that wall from, like, here? No. Motion detector feels like it'd be useless against him. He probably just never moves. Oh, his stamina is going down, dude, just over time. Very slowly, but it just went down a tick. He's like, he's definitely there, but I can't see him. <laughs> I'm too blind. Or he's behind, like, a bunch of cover. That's him. I'm pretty sure that's him. Yep, that was him. Get up and run, snake! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Oh, wait, did I? No, okay. For a second, I thought my stuff was draining again. Okay, I'm assuming he just ran again. Yeah, he's gone. Okay. 
On to the next part. Which is... Oh, shit. Hi. <laughs> Jesus. I thought you were gone. That grenade deafened me. That was cool, man. Normally in games, when, when somebody throws, like, a flashbang, you just can't see maybe have a little ringing in your ear but like everything just went completely quiet this is the end he's that way i would love first person mode right about now He on the ground or is that maybe him that little blip of red maybe the night vision the reason you were using it is for the uh the little blip right because you would get a blip off of his scope flashing as it's moving around. That's either not him or... This is the end. Must not be him. Either that or I'm missing. He sees me. That's not the right gun, Snake. <laughs> All right. Is he gone? No, he's still running around. He sounds close. He on the other side of that tree? This. Noodle, thank you so much for the five bits, love. That maybe I see a glint of light. That's him. Damn it, I missed. <laughs> I had him, but I missed. Okay, cure. Needle. Knife. Get up. I dislike this guy. 
Um, shit. He's quick. Quick to shoot, at least. Okay, I don't think he's going to get us from here. Uh, we're definitely going to have to eat some food. Let's try the instant noodles. We haven't tried those yet. We have a fair bit of them. I'm assuming it's just going to be like a few full, heal, full heal. Yeah. Damn good. So both the calorie mates and the instant noodles are full stamina recovery. So we probably want to wait until it gets like super low. I don't know if camo actually helps us in this situation or not. I guess I'll just leave what we have on. Mike. Yeah, you're still hiding up in that area where you just were. Can we just wait for him to, like, fall asleep? Is that an option? It's a bird. You would use animals, you think? I know the animals helps with, like, the sway of our gun. Which is why I was originally thinking of changing camo. But I didn't know if it would cover us as well here. I'm not sure, like, how much your camouflage affects his ability to see us right now. Actually, yes, what? <laughs> this is the end. I think that's him. I don't know though. Sleepy end takes forever though. Yeah. He's over here somewhere. Mike. This is the end. Weird how he just announces his name every now and then. Right there. Yep, that's him. All right. Got a couple shots out on him. <laughs> Is he going to move? Okay, I'm... Seems like he moved this time. Is he just going to be standing on the ground up here again, though? Or is he going to a different area? Is that him right there? No, that's a bird. That's his parrot. <laughs> or a parrot, I guess. <laughs> I 
Whatever, we'll take a parrot. Roughly that direction. Doesn't need a spotter, my ass. Uses the entire force as the spotter instead. that away Damn it, I can't see him. I know he's right over this hill somewhere, though. Subtitles help, too. Wait, do we not have subtitles turned on? Yeah, captions are on. That might be like an HD only thing or something for like just normal running around subtitles. Trying to see the glint from his thing. Night vision. This is the end. Everything seems too bright to be able to see a glint from his rifle scope. Bro's got to be around here somewhere. Come on. Where are you at? He hasn't even fallen asleep yet. This is the end. He's sounding really fucking close, though. Is that... That looks awfully suspicious. That could just be a bird or something, though. He's sleeping. Yep, that's definitely him, because we can see the sleeping things. Let's go. Okay. GG. <laughs> no re. Okay.
Bruh, did that not hit him? That looked so good. That's a bird. Did he leave? Is it finally time to go to the next area? I don't know. I don't trust him, man. <laughs> Last time I thought he left, he fucking smacked us in the... in the head. I hear him. Damn, I can't see anything with this tree, though. This is the end. He sounds close. No luck. Reposition. Maybe a little bit higher. Like behind this tree. Bro, <laughs> I, I dislike the end. Now, no, imagine not knowing to use the mic, right? That'd be insane, man. I mean, I imagine, like, Kojima's pretty good about giving hints, right? So if you call the Colonel, or Major Zero, I guess, in this game, or something. Like, they gotta tell you, hey, why don't you use the mic to try to hear him? So this would take, you would probably take until he dies of old age otherwise. <laughs> like... There's a dot of something on the ground. I don't know, he doesn't sound close, though. Like, I feel like I'm off a little bit. I need him to just fall back asleep is what I need. Oh, good, it's raining again. that him? That's not him, is it? On the ground? This is the end. Would he lay on the ground like that? There's something... Okay, well, he's sleeping. Absolutely, you think? I don't think it's him just because he's sleeping now and I don't see the Z's coming off of him. Otherwise, 100%, man. If we can hear him just snoring regularly, though, then we gotta be close. 
I wonder if he's hiding in that log. <laughs> like, we were just hiding in a log. Damn you, End. There he is. Actually, you know what? Just crawl into the thing. You're getting your fucking tablet? What, is it too hard to see? <laughs> yeah, see shit. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> It's quiet again. Uh, da, 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 da. Is there another area or just the two? Because she mentioned there being three. But, like, he hasn't gone to the third one yet. And he's about three quarters of the way dead. They're not dead, but knock the hell out. Okay, well, we're not getting anything from in here. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> that jump scared me. Uh, thermals and follow him, okay. Oh, but sneaky? Okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, he's right there. He's not, like, looking this direction, though, is he? Is he looking this way? Don't try to melee, you know it's tempting. Will he kick your ass or does he just like die instantly? <laughs> he might be a hell of a sniper, but I feel like he's not the world's greatest uh, meleeer, brawler. That is him. Can we shoot him more than once with the Trank? We can. Oh, shit. He blew up again. Nope. Okay. He's covered in grease, I swear. <laughs> oh, man. This is a hell of a lot faster than trying to track him down. I'll, I'll give you that much, dude. <laughs> with the, the directional mic. The other way was working, though. It was just taking a long-ass time. Yeah, we can still see his footprints right now. We don't even need the thermals at the moment.
he up there again? Yeah, he's totally right up there again. This is the end. That's him. Isn't it? I can't tell. Nope. Th that was a fucking bird or something. He was right next to it, though. <laughs> Snake, why are you on top of the log, you dumbass? Snake it down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Take out the anesthetic. <laughs> so, we were close, though. He was right there. We just... I don't know if we hit his bird or a bird or what, but we didn't hit him. Uh, anesthetic needle. Damn it, it's circle. Dig it out. And dig it out. And more food, please. Parrot captured alive. This bird looks familiar. <laughs> Dude, is it his bird? <laughs> Did we get his fucking bird? <laughs> I I think we fucking did. We found his bird and shot it. Oh my god. Nice. I just thought it was like a random parrot. I didn't think it was his parrot. Save and do the clock thing now? Will it be different? Fuck that old man. <laughs> oh, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna eat first. Um Just to disrespect. <laughs> Not <laughs> oh man. Oh shit, I didn't mean to. Is he still up there? He is still up there. Fuck you, old man. Let's go. Ugh. <laughs> You did good, old man. It's time for you to take the long sleep, though. I need to turn my headphones back down, too. Spirits of the forest, I thank you. The boss would be proud of you. The time has come for a younger generation to rise. Okay, yeah, so... I guess it was just an identical bird. Wandering for more than a century, and now my journey. Or he just uses parrots in general. What a splendid way to end it all. I have no regrets. I can return. Oh, maybe. The fuck? Why does teeth pop out, dude? <laughs> oh, because you know he's got to blow up now. Get his shit and blow. Okay. What the? F Is the forest literally clearing a path for us now? Kind of anime bullshit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay. Uh. So far, nothing. Here's the camo.
Let's equip it. Because I imagine that'll come in handy for... Something. Wait, so he doesn't drop camo at all? He just drops the things? Or does he drop both? Backpack. Weapon. You thought he had moss camo? Maybe it's just like somewhere else. Wait, is that? How do we aim again? No, that's a fucking flower. I don't know what I'm listening for exactly. Oh, Jesus Christ. I can't hear shit with that going on, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bo looks normal, man. Like, normal, normal now. Or is the bird just, like, running around here somewhere? Like, not in the area? Do we need to leave for it? Oh, you had to hold him up to get it. Oh, well. Oh. I think I hear it, though, man. Oh, no, it's a fucking goat. I thought maybe the parrot just made weird noises because it's a parrot. <laughs> oh, well. All right. Uh, Where the hell are we going, though? Map it up. It is nice colors, Noodle. I agree. Uh, This way, maybe? the goat being here. Don't! I didn't want to jump down. Son of a bitch. Probably have to go back around now, huh? Oh, okay. That's not actually that bad. I thought we were going to have to run a lot farther around to get back up here. No, don't go off the fucking ledge again. This way? Yep. This is definitely the mystical... Wait a second. Is this the underground tunnel that needed a key? That Eva was talking about? Or is the door inside this tunnel? The door is probably inside this tunnel. Animal camo is probably going to be useless in here. Glitter is pretty good, though. Yeah, that's the best. Okay. Base. Uh, might as well wear splitter. Splitter with splitter. Ocean detector? Oh, they're bats. I was like, why is it detecting so much? Is there a person up here? No, it must just be more bats or something. Flashbang? Does that, like, get rid of them? Or do they just, like... Get angry AF? Oh! Holy sh... That also... All kinds of food, dude. Then eat till you puke... Wait, for real? Do you puke if you eat too much? Barely noticeable. <laughs> Disgusting. You think you get sick? This is horrible. 
The question is, do we need to, like, exit the menu like we do with the spinning thing? Nope. Keep going. Oh, we can. You got this, Snake. I believe in you. That's all the fresh or all of the non fresh food that we have. Will it continue on if we go back into it now? I want to see Snake throw up. No? Okay. Sick. Oh well. It's worth a try. Uh, well, I mean, there's only one way to go, so. Up we go. Very tall tunnel. What a thrill with darkness and silence through the night. What a thrill. I'm searching. I'll melt you into what a fear in my heart. But you're so supreme. Is this? This is the freaking song from the game, ain't it? That is what you're singing. I think that's what you're singing. <laughs> I can't think of what else it would be. Oh. It's the song. <laughs> That mean there's somebody up here with a radio? In my time, there'll be no one it's the long freaking ladder, dude. Kojima, what are you doing, man? thing we filled up our stamina <laughs> it's gonna use it all climbing this stupid ass ladder bro is this just a trick ladder does it go forever nope okay there we go thank god <laughs> All right, I need to... Oh, no, don't go back down it. Don't go back down it. Nope, not doing that. <laughs> I need to turn the game back down before we get into actual game. There we go. Roughly there. All right, presumably we can just go out without anything too bad happening, right? Yeah. Mountain base. we got to be getting close to the end, right? Because we've gone through most of the lackeys, the boss's lackeys. It's a very famous ladder. I can imagine why. This looks safe. But that's honestly what worries me. Grenade and serum. Motion detector back on. I see no motion. Half expecting there to be mines. It's a big drop, dude. Okay. Should I be pulling out the mine detector? There's some... Saw dude. Thankfully, we have this now. Oh, 
How the fuck do we shoot? <laughs> Square, probably, huh? Change camo. That's a good idea. Huh? What? Oh, shit. Yeah, it is loud. I didn't think about that. Mm -hmm. I'm so used to using <laughs> the fucking silencer. Well, you know, it's fine. Uh, chocolate chip's pretty good. Animals is surprisingly still one of the best ones. Animals really is like A tier camo, huh? This is HQ. Control here. We're under fire. We need to get to an unknown. I'm in the orange now. Maybe go back to silence weapon. Too bad we can't get a silencer for that. That'd be pretty cool. But definitely OP. Uh, and motion detector would probably be useful here. Wait. Our camo is surprisingly good. 95% when we're not moving. Ninety when we are moving, like those are just birds flying above, right? Yeah. I think we're okay. Those two are passing. There's still two more. Back there somewhere. Is that a hole in the side of the mountain? Can I safely get to it? Oh, there's scorpions here too, huh? That's what some of the little dots are on the ground. Oh shit. Ninety-five percent camo just broken, or ninety percent? <laughs> what the fuck was that, dude? <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> that. God damn it! Oh god, this freaking game, dude. It makes no sense at all. <laughs> Just staring at me as I'm crawling past him. Over and over again. It's a weird-ass cat, dude. That's all. Don't worry about it. Now, this dude just passed out, right? Yeah, okay. We're back to save. Uh, don't stand up. Thank you. Just grenades, huh? Deeply flawed masterpieces, yes. That it is. Are there any more people back? This guy had a freaking grenade launcher? Glad we didn't accidentally piss him off. Damn it. Okay, can I just jump down from here? Is there... Down snake? 
I see two people off in the distance there. I'm tempted to just crawl past them, though. If the camo's that good, like... Especially with how low on shots we are here. A little bit safer, I guess, to take them all out, though. So we will. Is that everyone, though? I think so. Because we really need to try and get more ammo. I don't think any of these guys are going to drop ammo for the Trank, though. Yeah, M37. Thought that boulder was a person or a giant scorpion. For a second, I thought we were playing Fallout. Spoonful of peanut butter and coffee with the International Delight Sweet and Creamy Creamer is Chef's Kiss. I mean, I'm glad you like it. I'm not a huge fan of peanut butter. Although, peanut butter and coffee do go pretty well together. Like, with my uh, protein shakes that I was drinking for a little while. That was a really good combination. Smoke grenade. Hmm. Hmm. On to the next one. Let's go. And you have all three kitties on the couch? I'm so happy for you. Peanut butter is amazing, especially in Reese shapes. I do agree it's better in Reese cups. I don't know about Reese's shapes. You look like someone we should just ignore. Is that... No, that's spinning. Okay. I thought that was a thing for a second. A, uh... Whatchamacallit. Just a weird animal. You see nothing. Damn it, why won't you go where I want you to go? There we go. SVD. And a dope. M37. It's on the ground. Oh, that's a scorpion. Nineteen eleven A one. I really want some MK twenty two, if you don't mind. Nope, AK forty seven. Okay. Maybe in this random hole in the wall. I'm assuming we could probably use the sniper to take out the helicopter, but, like, I don't think there's any way the helicopter's going to see us, to be honest. Not if we just crawl around with animal camo on and desert face paint. in the hole. I gotta know. Anything worthwhile? They just like using this as an ammo cache? The helicopter sounds a lot closer though. Hey, there we go. There's some bullets. down dude where's the freaking hole Is this the hole there's the hole motion see that looks like a vulture up there 
I don't see any people. We're gonna round this corner. There's just gonna be a person chilling right there. No? Okay. Oh, God. No, okay. We're good. We're good. If you have any Reese's eggs left next time, you're gonna put that in your coffee? That sounds iffy to me. Okay, I think we have to stand up. I'm just a tall animal taking a look, that's all. You didn't see anything suspicious. Oh, wait. Are they just vultures? Okay, well. I'll eat some vulture meat. Wait. Why you... Uh... Okay. <laughs> I guess we just can't take that alive, which... Fair, I guess. Works with only truffle balls. Why not a Reese egg? I mean, fair. Like I said, I like the protein powder with uh, peanut butter in it. So I'm sure it would taste good with a Reese's egg. Or with peanut butter and coffee powder. Do I... Do I need to take down that? Oh, hi. Ungodly camo's ungodly. <laughs> Why does it work so good? Anyways, if he can walk down this path, I'm assuming I can crawl up it. It's going to take a long time to crawl up this thing, though. Should we just be running? Like, is all of this crawling pointless? Do you see another guy up there, though? Was this like a... Oh. When the heli isn't around yet. Can we take down the heli with the sniper? I mean, we would instantly go into... Uh, whatchamacallit mode. Huh. Because of the sound, I imagine. Plus, I mean, the helicopter falling out of the sky is probably a pretty good sign that, hey, somebody's around here. I need you to turn around for a second. I feel like we'd be fine if we crawled right past this dude, but I'm also not trying to get caught. Go ahead. Turn around. Any second now. There you go. Good boy. Uh, that's just some sort of healing thing. I don't really care. Do we go up that way? Or around that way? I don't know which one's correct, but I'm going to try going around this way. This looks heavily guarded. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. Keep crawling. Keep crawling. So far, so good. Where'd that dude go? Oh, there's one. Of course, I can't see him in this mode. In first person. Get a little closer to the edge so I can see you, my guy. I just want to say a howdy-do, you know? There he is. There must have been a guy behind him. Yep, I see him now. Can I get you out, too?
Damn you. Now, which way are the reinforcements going to come from? Are they even going to actually come? Because it seems like in some areas of the game, reinforcements never actually come. There's another dude back there. Oh, okay. A couple of them just spawned in. <laughs> I'm guessing it's all the crawling, but I am very hungry. This camo has no business being this good, my guy. <laughs> like... The caution keeps being reset, but like nobody sees me. I should probably check this building though, huh? You never know what's gonna be in it. Explore, yeah, I'm going to. Uh, food. Emperor scorpion, is it good? I know some people like scorpions. Eh, barely noticeable. Well, moderate, nice. White rumped vulture. Very good, huh? I never would have guessed vulture meat would have been good, you know? <clears throat> Doesn't exactly sound good to me. Oh, hi, froggy. Just some rations. Okay. And there might be something in that building there, too. The other reason I didn't originally go in that building was because I feel like there's a drop down, so I'm going to have to stand up to go in there, and the helicopter sounded really close. Plus, I expected more people to show up, but surprisingly, no. It was just these I thought four but I guess three splint serum disinfect hmm. okay well I mean hey extra rations are nice I'm gonna wait for the helicopter to GG I don't know if it'll be able to see me in here or not but I could see it, and that's scary enough for me. Is it more or less gone? I think it's more or less gone. Is that another building down there? Yes, it is. Okay. I'll check it, too. The okay, helicopter's gone. You didn't see anything. RPG! Let's go! Portable rocket launcher. Use scope with L1. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm assuming that's ammo. You're just seeing things. Nothing here but a very large cat that sometimes walks on its hind legs. Back to normal. This is HQ. <laughs> no problem. That's why you couldn't determine it, because it doesn't exist. Is it gone enough to leave? I think it's gone enough to leave. Let's go, dude. Mountain top. Are we about to walk into a huge cutscene soon? Okay. 
Okay. Uh. Helicopter very close now. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to save real quick, because it's been a while since we've dropped a proper save. And I'm going to see if I can just crawl past all these dudes. Do you want to save? Yes. Yes, I do. I would love to save. Eventually. It's working on it. <laughs> it's a PS2, man. It's a little slow sometimes. It's still going. It's getting there. It's getting there. There we go. Save successful. Hey, Snake. Have you ever seen Forbidden Planet? I have not. Tell me all about it. It's about this expedition that goes to the planet Altair 4 in an ultra-fast spaceship. When they arrive, they meet the survivor of the last expedition, Dr. Morbin time! Dr. Morbius was exploring the planet along with his daughter, Altera, and the versatile Robbie the Robot. Ignoring the doctor's warnings, the expedition team is suddenly attacked by an invisible creature called the Monster from the Id. The special effects they use for the science stuff are really neat. I wish I had a robot like Robbie that could make anything I wanted it to. I'm more interested in that invisible monster. If I were invisible, I wouldn't have to bother hiding or wearing camouflage. Maybe someday you'll be able to turn invisible. Yeah, that'll be the day. I mean, we've done seen people that can do it. Like, <laughs> I don't <laughs> I don't think it's that far fetched, my guy. Okay. Now I wonder, is there anything around here? I guess there are some buildings. What are the chances they give us an RPG and something else though, like that close to each other? Nothing too important? Okay. I didn't figure, but so it, I don't know, it just feels weird for them to give us like two weapons back to back. Are two really good items in general back to back. Now, if I knock you out, is somebody else gonna get angry? Because you're kind of in my path. Oh, shit. Yeah, I know. I know it's close to nine. That's why I was like, is there gonna be a long cutscene or anything that we need to worry about? Also, before I forget, equip another suppressor. <laughs> didn't realize our other one ran out. <laughs> I felt that's... I know. <laughs> Thankfully, we're basically invisible. Is this door going to be locked? Okay, this must be later. That or it's one of those things we can knock. There's a key here, okay. We're just, oh, is that the door that we need to get to? The the underground tunnel door or whatever? That's, that's locked that needs a special key? I guess that could be the one she was talking about. Anything over here? Or am I wasting my time? I'm wasting my time. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, no, I am. Okay. Turn around. Don't stand up, snake. Can I get up on this without standing up? No. Super sneaky. <laughs> da 
good. I think I'm at an impasse, though. This camo's too good. <laughs> like, legit, too freaking good. I don't know where to go. Uh, if I can knock you out, or not. Damn, someone saw me. Well, it was a good run. Since we're in alert, not in evasion, I feel like we're going to be spotted easily. Yeah. Oh, damn. They set off the whole alarms, too. Oh, boy. Uh... <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Snake, why are you punching the wall? <laughs> oh my god, I'm useless. Uh, We can probably go back to regular guns now. <laughs> Backpack. Weapon. Yeah, I'm 1911. Oh my god, that helicopter does not seem friendly. At least I can use this chance to maybe just figure out where the key is that I need. Is it in this one? TNT, bunch of different bullets. There's the door that I can't get in. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Where am I trying to go? What section of the map haven't I explored yet? Oh, top right. There's just... I can just leave? How did I miss that? Oh, God, dude. <laughs> We're fine. Everything's fine. Just keep running. Get down in the trench. Trenches are here for a reason. Okay, not when there's dudes shooting you, though. Oh, hey, the door's open now. <laughs> okay, so top right, though, it seems like is where we're trying to get to. Now we know. Continue. All right. Uh, I'm assuming, yeah, I was going to say, it probably didn't re-equip our suppressor for us. So let's do that. We know you're going to end up being a problem. So we might as well just take you out now. And we know that we need to cross that bridge over there. So we might as well just cross here. And now we crawl. Still not sure how to get all the way up to where we need to go. But... We have an idea. Wait, no, we didn't need to cross that bridge, did we? Some bitch, this map is confusing me. Unless, can we go... Around? And up? 
Probably not, huh? It's worth a shot. Does this circle around or does it just dead end? It dead ends. Okay. Round. And back. I don't think there's anyone in the trench for a little while. Maybe we just drop down into the trench? When the helicopter's not around? AKA not right now? Okay. Now's probably our best chance. We still got the really good camo. God damn it, they're looking at each other. It's just a cat with a gun. <laughs> Nothing to worry about there. Like, how do you... I know suppressors make guns quieter, but they don't completely get rid of the sound, dude. Like, how do you just completely miss that? Okay, so this way... And from here, do we just keep following the trench? I'm assuming maybe. There's the gun. Oh, there's a guy, too. Like, okay, map. Where are we on the map right now? Looks kind of like we just need to go down and circle around. I think following the trench is the right move. I'm not worried about that guy. I don't think he's going to see us. Anyone forward? Nope. I think we got it this time. Without getting caught. I'm pretty sure that's just a piece of wood. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> that, that, like, top to the box or whatever that was chilling there. Or no, that's not a box. That's just ground. Whatever. Look, it can be kind of hard to tell sometimes. In the door. Let's go, dude. And a cutscene to finish it off. Hopefully not a boss fight. <laughs> if it is a boss fight, well, I guess we can just roll back the clock if there's another weird clock thing going on. I don't think they'd do that twice in one game, though, right? Right? I don't think so. Oh, well, hello there. Nice to see you again. some rest I'll be fine it's just our one a lot <laughs> why'd she kick the boots back behind her that was weird he found out if he knew I'd be dead already no this is his hobby he's a sadist he gets pleasure out of making people suffer he's scum Does it look that strange to you? No. I'm the same way. Scars all over. Can I see? No. Where'd you get this one? I got it after defecting to the Soviet Union. 
Controller keeps giving slight vibrations, but so far R1 hasn't popped up at all. Desk job. Where'd you get this kind of scar? You really want to know? Hmm. Well, too bad. Which I'm honestly kind of surprised about. Some secrets, you know. But enough about that. You've got to get going. The phase two trial of the Shagglehot is about to start, and it looks like someone might be coming to spoil the party. Khrushchev? His forces are on their way here. The colonel is gathering his troops. It's pretty much any time he was on screen, yeah. I'm not surprised, dude. Kojima. Even tighter than it is now. You'll need this key. It unlocks the door to the underground tunnel. Once you're in there, you can follow the tunnel to get inside Groznygrad. And take this too. Hey, more instant ramen. Let's go. What is it? Bro, you know, you've literally eaten it before. <laughs> for the space age. It's good to eat some real food once in a while. The only thing Kojima likes more than women, apparently. Ramen noodles. <laughs> you taste like a wild beast. It's good to eat real food, yeah. Real food. <laughs> Ramen fucking noodles. Sokolov is located. He's in the heart of the fortress, the weapons lab. The weapons lab is divided into three wings. There's the east wing, which houses the research facilities. Then there's the main wing where the weapons are assembled. That's where the Shagohot is. Finally, there's the west wing, which is connected via a passageway to the main building. That's where Sokolov is. To get He's in the, the west. Enter the main wing from the east wing. Okay. Then... Go through the passageway on the second floor of So we're starting on east. We have to make our way all the way over to the Got it. other side. <laughs> the opposite side of where we enter, of course. Not again. The west wing is protected by the highest level of security. You need to be colonel class to get in. Colonel class? Here. Look at this picture. You should make a note, you really think? <laughs> you just got to get to the other side of the building. I think, I hope I can remember that. <laughs> we start on the right side, or A side. I think it's the west side we start on, right? Steel is close. And then we go to the middle and then to the you east. Look similar from behind, they won't know the difference. Your face might be a problem, so you just have to figure something out. You Thank God we got that mask. That mask looks suspiciously a lot like him. <laughs> How am I supposed to escape once I get Sokolov out of there? Command <laughs> said you're supposed to have something ready for me. And I do. There's a lake 30 miles north of here. Oh, just 30 miles, huh? A wig there. A wig? It's a state-of-the-art ground effect vehicle. A ground effect vehicle? I can't fly one of those. That's okay. I happen to be an excellent pilot. Taking off from a lake is trickier than it looks. It's not like riding a motorcycle. You've got to be more delicate. Of course I will. You've seen how good I am with the bike, right? Hmm. Right. You handle the escape then. I'll head for Groznygrad. Wait a What's minute. What's up the focus on the shoes? For kicking you. the boots behind, the mark what? on her boot. What's the story between you and the boss? She was like a mother, and my master. And your lover? He went deeper than that. Deeper? Half of me belongs to the boss. Do you love her? No, nothing like that. Do you hate her? Does it have to be one or the other? Love or hate? Between a man and a woman? You bet. For ten years, we lived and died together. You couldn't possibly understand. And you think you can kill her now? Uh. That's your mission, isn't it? Assassinating the boss? You got this, Snake. 
Snap's mate. Snap out of it, my guy. Someone special? I've never been interested in other people's lives. You were interested in the boss. She was different. Really? How do you feel about me? I should be asking you the same question. Me? Really not the time, my guys. If it's part of the mission? Even with you. Snake? No reaction at all. Well, hate to break up the party. <laughs> the cheetah suit has this effect. Exactly, man. That cheetah pattern is just undeniable. <laughs> See you around, Snake. Take care of yourself. What about you? I've got to hurry back and play my other part. Are you going to be okay? Not sure. They're not stupid and they know there's a spy. There's no way you could have gotten this far all by yourself. Kind of rude. True, but kind of rude. Even if she's that good of a driver, man, I don't think there's any way that motorcycle's taking all that. Oh, look, it's our friend. He's a little pissed off. <laughs> to be frank, the boss does have a collection of your disassembled guns. That's <laughs> perfectly normal. Oh, damn, dude. I thought that was oil coming out of the barrel. I didn't... Didn't realize. Did he talk? No. He died before I could get it out of him. Was it the spy, then? This a transmitter? Exactly. Planted to keep someone informed of his location. But does this mean Granin was the spy? Perhaps he was being used by someone else. Perhaps. This man was our comrade. Comrade or not, he's of no use to us now. I don't approve of your methods. I don't need your approval. I'm in command here. And that nuclear shell? Still feeling sore about that, are you? What are you gonna do? Report it to the authorities? This is war, Major. The Cold War, fought with information and espionage. We must root out spies wherever they hide. It is kill or be killed. Potential threats must be weeded out. Your feelings are a menace to the unity of our organization. Someone is guiding the enemy's hand. A single man can only accomplish so much. Make no mistake, there is a spy among us. But casting suspicion on our own comrades. The C3 explosives have been stolen. You think it was the American? No. He 
could not have reached this fortress yet. Then who? Pretty damn close, though, my guy. Can we just like sniper shot them now? We have two different sniper rifles on us. Where have you been? The fear and the end have fallen. CIA dog? That leaves only the fury. How can the legendary Cobras be beaten so easily? No worries. He's spinning the bolt gun. He'll <laughs> spin any gun you give him. For him. Awesome. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll take care of him. What is he after? Must be more than just Sokolov. America is out to destroy the Shagrahat and get its hands on your inheritance. The Philosopher's legacy. Huh? Impossible. The legacy, it... Then they're out to kill me as well. Colonel, tighten the security on this place. He's coming here. I'm sure of it. I don't even know what the hell the legacy is. I'm just here to kill you and save Sokolov. That's all I really want. Crockett. What the fuck's the Davy Crockett? Oh, okay, okay. That makes sense. Hmm? Perfume. boots is it gonna have a scuff mark on it Make sure that's Sokolov's properly. isn't that Sokolov's wife so uh, Eva Eva whatever the hell her name was is Sokolov's wife how is she slipping away from them to I'm so confused <laughs> I guess that's why there was a focus on the shoes. That makes sense now. All right. Well, with that, guys, it's been a ton of fun, but uh, it is after 9 o'clock, and I have steak I need to go cook because it is past my dinner time, and I am super hungry. So we're going to save the game, see whatever movie she wants to tell us about, and then we're going to call it a night. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me while we played some Metal Gear Solid 3. I'm guessing 100% guessing one more week maybe one more week maybe two but I'm, I'm thinking one because I mean there's only the one boss left in like the end of the game right but I don't know it's a Kojima game lord only knows plus the average completion time is what like I don't know maybe it was like 16 hours maybe maybe two more weeks I guess only time will tell I guess I'm saying I guess a lot <laughs> Two or three, you think? Really? No shit. Okay. Okay. It feels like we should be closer to the end than that, but I've never played it before, Snake, so... Have you seen Earth versus the Spider? No, but I killed nope. the spider. It's about this spider that suddenly mutates into a giant monster. They bring it into the city in a state of hibernation, but it wakes up and starts wrecking the place. So why did the spider turn huge? I told you. It suddenly mutated. Yeah, right. Snake... It's people like you that take all the fun out of watching movies. <laughs> Always nitpicking and taking things too seriously. Honestly, why even bother? Look, the important thing isn't that it got big. Then what is important? The fact that there's a huge spider destroying the city. <laughs> Suspend your disbelief. That's the whole point of movies. It doesn't need to necessarily be a good reason, but there should be at least some reason. Like maybe it crawled through a vat of 
nuclear waste from the local power plant or something. I don't know. There should at least be some reason, right? I'm with you on that one. But anyways, guys, like I said, that is it for tonight. Thank you all again so much. I appreciate you all. And uh, until next time, be kind to each other. Bye-bye, y'all.